With Respawn Week being here until next Tuesday, Tuesday the 15th, it means we can take advantage of certain bosses dropping certain items. Today we cover a boss which drops must have grenades. How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and I'd like to thank you for stopping by and checking out my video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like truly helps out and subscribe if you want to see more Borderlands 3. Also guys, I'm giving away copies of Borderlands every week. To win one for yourself or a friend, simply subscribe and make sure you have notifications turned on. Drop a like on this video and leave a comment down below. So within Borderlands 3 there are grenades which are considered must haves. I've uploaded videos on a few mainly the Firestorm variants capable of this. But there are others out there which too are considered probably even better than the Firestorm. One comes to mind called the Hex, which comes in many, many variants. Today's boss until next week, meaning you have from this upload, this video's release, a full five or six days to farm to get this grenade mod you want. As this boss during this week has increased chances of dropping any legendary grenade mod. So the boss is called the Red Jabba and he's located upon Ambermere on Eden 6. So spawn into Ambermere and follow the route I take on screen now to this enemy's location. So once here, kill him, hope for that loot. If not, simply quit out and load back in. The save point and the place you will spawn back in is the fast travel spot, but in all honesty people, it doesn't take too long getting back here. Now I will state, doing this offline doesn't seem to work, as it takes away any patches or updates applied to the game, and proof of this is the fact that it's now Rare Hunt week, and the bosses in which we can take advantage of are guaranteed to show up and when in fact it isn't this rare hunt week, there's only a slight chance they will be here. And my first attempt going offline and actually going to this red jabber location, he wasn't here. So it kind of proves to the fact that the patches and updates don't apply to offline playing. Now I did load in and out about 5 or 6 times on offline mode and he appeared here once. So it's pretty rare. But what I did check when he eventually did appear here offline, can he drop legendaries and can he drop legendary grenade mods? Well it seems people he can, but I wouldn't say any more efficiently than anywhere else playing offline. So it does seem as though people your best bet in getting that perfect grenade mod is to do this online. I was getting a grenade mod roughly every 2 or 3 runs and that's without any luck artifact applied. So give this a try people and try and get that grenade mod you want. What you can also do people to get anything you want is join my discord linked within the video description. I have dedicated sections for playstation, xbox and pc for trading so if you come here with a certain item you think is worth trading you may may get something you need in return. So yeah, my discord is linked within the video description. But on that note guys, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you are new around here and want to see more Borderlands 3, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.